All right. So a brother from India has emailed me yesterday about that uh, he got a postdoctoral position in County Limerick uh, at the University of Limerick and his postdoc salary is around 41,000 uh, euro per year and he is asking what is the condition, uh, economic condition uh, in Ireland presently and how is the living condition, whether uh, this salary will be sufficient for one or two persons and so on. So, uh, first of all, I'm, I congratulate uh, that brother and I, uh, I really appreciate that he sent me an email um, by what, after watching my YouTube videos about postdoc salary and so on so let's be very real and let's see how it goes so uh, just to give you some idea that i also started my uh, postdoc uh, job exactly 15 months ago and i started with salary 39,000 uh, euro per year and i do postdoc in county sligo and the brother is in uh, will be in uh, county limerick so and my current salary is uh, 43 point something uh, because they sort of increase every uh, three or four months i <coughs> do not have much idea but at the end of the day um, uh, after the first year or so you will be getting not more than like 2600 or something so um, so monthly uh, after the tax deduction it depends on the yearly salary rate for example i started 39 the brother is studying 41 so on an average uh, 2500 means 2500 euro to 2600 euro after the tax uh, several sort of tax deduction and so on so let's say uh, after the tax deduction he gets uh, in hand 2600 euro per month okay so the first thing he will do after coming to ireland is that he will search for an accommodation right so search for an to search for an accommodation he will go to daft daft.ie so this is the uh, daft.ie the uh, only one and only uh, website uh, in uh, in Ireland to search uh, uh, like um, your accommodation right so now um, I believe that he will be as he will be coming uh, he said that uh, it is either for one person or two person so let's assume that he is coming with his uh, first of all assume that he is coming alone and then let's say he wants to share uh, with some people and so click on the share and then click on the limerick so you see that right now 27 properties are available to share in limerick city right so this is uh, 495 per month i believe these are all excluding electricity bills and other sort of bills so whatever rent uh, you see you can add another like 150 euro for all the bills for monthly so for for for, for say 500 let's say 500 plus 150 uh, so 650 uh, total and by the way this is per week you should uh, not per month right so 260 per week 150 per week and and there are some sort of double room apartment so generally sharing means it may be a three bedroom or two bedroom or four bedroom house there are other students or other people and you probably will uh, get one uh, one bedroom one single bedroom and probably bathroom uh, need to be shared and kitchen needs needs to be shared with um, other people in the house so you can see 525 450 400 uh, 500 625 700 so if you see the uh, uh, like more than 600 or 700 then you can 
uh, understand that it's a kind of little bit of bigger room and less number of people in the house but if it is right less uh, like 450 below 500 then there will be minimum like uh, three to four people in the house and 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 mostly room size is small and so on on this is my experience over the last five years in ireland so yeah so you can you see said if if he uh, so on an average you can see that it is like 600 euro uh, 600 euro uh, for the rent and another 150 for the um, uh, for the uh, bills so i assume that 750 euro uh, is go is going to for the living purpose if if he is coming alone so if he is coming alone then 750 for 750 euro for the rent 750 euro for the rent and uh, now uh, uh, along with 750 i assume that for a single person 200 euro is sufficient for the food and another 100 euro for the transport per month so rent food and transport and uh, so this is very basic right you you have to stay somewhere so that's rent you have to eat uh, and 200 euro per month i am assuming that most of the days he will be cooking by himself and he will buy groceries from uh, usual uh, indian and uh, irish shops so if he has a, like uh, going to restaurant and buying coffee every day from the from the luxurious uh, coffee shops and luxurious restaurant then 200 will not be sufficient you can you have to spend like more than 400 euro per month if you are uh, eating outside in ireland so anyway for the time being i assume 200 uh, uh, so 750 for the rent 200 for the food and 100 euro for the transport i assume that he will be staying a little bit far from the university and he has to commute with the buses or um, buses or taxis or whatever um, so in that case i will suggest uh, depending on where he is staying i will suggest to buy a uh, either electric bicycle uh, if he has a plan to stay for long term and uh, or or a bicycle uh, that will save some money from the for the transport and what else and um, uh, some um, some food uh, some clothing and so on but uh, I, we do not buy clothes every month so i'm just uh, counting only the basic exp basic expenses which is for single person uh, 750 for the rent and 200 for the food and 100 for the transport so as a whole uh, zero five uh, so around 1550 euro or maybe let's say 1100 euro per month for the very basic sort of um, expenses right now let's see um, if he comes with his wife or partner or um, so let's say for the two person so for two person uh, it is almost impossible to get a sharing house right so um, you have to rent right then you go to rent and you click the limerick and and you need at least um, one bedroom or at max two bedroom right so generally if there is no children uh, with the couple then couple generally finds a one bedroom apartment all right so let's see how what's the price of one bedroom uh, apartment for rent in uh, in the limerick so in limerick one bedroom apartment one bedroom apartment okay so one bedroom apartment one bathroom apartment is 2250 per month and it is only two properties are available at the moment and this is what this property is one one thousand six hundred per month at the moment 
right so you see as soon as you move to a like uh, renting it is very much a big jump from the sharing so this is the condition for limerick and this is the same condition for every other uh, counties in ireland at the moment i think uh, i think the most horrible conditions are in dublin cork and galway uh, even one bedroom apartment you see 2250 and the brother is going to get a salary of per month so this is 2250 per month for the rent okay so you have to include uh, you have to include another like 200 uh, euro uh, per month for the electricity bill gas bill and every other bill so basically 2250 plus another 200 so 2450 so 2000 450 euro will go for the uh, one bedroom one bath apartment if he gets this apartment uh, by chance and then he will be left only uh, 150 euro uh, for uh, for his um, from from his salary monthly salary postdoc salary so on the other hand if he gets this apartment Mm, uh, one bedroom one bedroom apartment for example 1650 1650 per month and then add another 200 euro for the electricity bill and everything so it is around like 1850 uh, uh, per month then uh, he will get like uh, after deduction from his salary 2600 i assumed he will be having like 400 euro uh, 600 euro uh more than 600 euro like uh, yeah like uh, 7 or 800 euro uh, in his pocket uh, for spending for food and whatever so you see that uh, the, this is very random like uh, it's all your luck what apartment you will be getting and uh, where you will be getting and how much will be the price it's completely a random variable and it's uh, completely luck and depends on what is available when you are coming uh, when you are searching in ireland uh, on which county so but the average is i would say for one bedroom at the moment 1650 you can you can this is not less than that that i can guarantee at the moment even in sligo and any other counties so if it is a two bedroom uh, it will be let's say if you want to two bedroom Let's see two bedroom apartment in Limerick. How much is it? It is two bedroom. So this is only one available two bedroom apartment. It's two hundred twenty two thousand one hundred per month, and then you add another two hundred euro for the electricity bill. So it's two thousand. Uh, 300 euro uh, per month for the two bedroom apartment in limerick and this is only one available so it's very difficult to get uh, at the moment so now uh, he will his salary monthly salary will be took 2600 as a postdoc so he will be left with 300 euro for living his life in uh, limerick if he gets this apartment two bedroom apartment so you see so this is the ha- housing situation at the moment in ireland for the post docs and okay a couple of uh, so i i i hope he gets an uh, uh, reasonable apartment but that i that's only a hope i don't know what will be the reality when he will coming to ireland and uh, search for his home now a couple of other things uh, i would be i would like to uh mention here that uh, i would like to mention here is that when he when you as a postdoc or phd student will come to ireland uh, the two things you have to do is to uh, book a pps apartment a pps appointment and book for an uh, go to a nearest aib bank to book uh, to open a bank account so unless you get your pps and your bank account your university will not be able to pay your salary so as soon as you land in your place in limerick 
you should uh, book uh, an appointment with AIB Bank and you should book an appointment with PPS uh, PPS number office in your county. That's all. Thank you.